How's it going YouTube? Chris here at my home theater. Brand new video for you this afternoon. So guys, I know you uh, remember me talking about that I ordered some new seats for my theater and they were supposed to be delivered on the 28th of this month. And so I had plenty of time to get the painting done, to kind of tie things up in here, get the carpet done. And lo and behold, the seats came today, a whole two weeks early. So let's turn this camera around and let's see what I got done and then we'll go from there. So guys, as you can see, um, I got the doors painted. I got the second coat of black on the walls. Uh, I got my acoustic panels put up. Got them put up here, here. And the walls look good. I am absolutely just, I wish I'd have, I wish I'd have went ahead and just painted black to start with. So many people said, paint it all black, paint it all black. I wanted something different. I like the gray. The gray was a, it was a beautiful color gray. I'm probably going to use that color in the house somewhere. <laughs> uh, loved it. But as far as the theater goes, the black, it just, it just, it, it spoke to me and I had to do it and I love it. So, uh, I'm probably going to do the trim something maybe a little different. Don't know yet. I might do a, uh, some kind of color. I don't know yet, but anyway, let's talk about these acoustic panels. Guys, these acoustic panels are amazing. I love the way they look. A lot of people said, Hey, that's kind of reminiscent of Eddie Van Halen. Eddie Van Halen is the greatest guitarist that's ever been in my opinion. I mean, nobody can play the guitar like him except his son Wolfgang. And I'm telling you, his son can play the guitar just like he can. But still, he's the greatest guitarist in the world. So when I saw when I saw these, of course I jumped on them because I like them, I like the way they look. Uh, I think they're going to perform well. Uh, the backs, I think I showed them on on the other video. They kind of they kind of looks like the stuff they used on uh for uh, like box springs or something. So they got a very unique look. Uh, the way they mount, it's got two little brackets and they just slide in there. I think it's aluminum frame. I mean, guys, these, 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 these things are amazing. So I got these two up here and I got one here. And the only way I could put one there is because of the door. So I want everything to kind of be uniformed. Uh, should the reflection points should be good for the seats and all. And I got that one back here. So what I what I decided to do is I'm going to take these down, and I've ordered two more of these. So I will have I'm gonna have there, there'll be three on each wall, but I have one here and two back here, and up here I have two up there and one back here. I don't think it'll make that big a difference, but it's just kind of a reverse of each other, the way I see it. So I'll have six panels in here. Diffusers on the front, diffusers on the back. Probably gonna do um, a couple of more diffusers up here. I got a, I got a whole stack right here, so I'm gonna do a couple of. Uh, I'm gonna do at least two more here, and I got a cut out for that. And then somebody mentioned something about, and I've been looking for something to kind of make the whole look finished out, which I did. If you see that I, I did paint in there, but I want it to look better. Give it a more finished look. And I, I got so many panels left over. I may do a couple panels down or I may come under. I don't I don't know exactly how I'm gonna do it yet, but I'm working on it. So I think the room looks amazing and I'm pretty happy with it. I, I, I need to do something. I wish they would have had the the black or the gray or whatever, but I may shoot, I may put a decal over them. I, I do signs and decals, I make shirts, I make all kind of stuff. So, But I may leave it to white because it kind of does contrast off of that. So, so guys, I still haven't got this carpet done. Gotta get this carpet done. Because through that door is my couch and I gotta get this thing hooked up. So what I'm working on now, you see I got my XLR cables, got a power cable here. Uh, I got my amp set up here because I didn't have any room down here once I added the seven channel outlaw, which is a fantastic amp. I'm gonna keep it, it's not going anywhere. But I will be 
upgrading these, it'll be after Christmas. I, I, I can't do it right now. So I'll be getting rid of the rock wheels and I'm gonna add, I wanna add a, a, a DR3 and at least a XPR, let's see, that's two, four, six, a six channel, uh, a XPA six channel or five, or whatever I need, six channel, seven channel, whatever they offer. I think they do offer a six channel, even Tiva. So I need to pick up a couple more amps and uh, we'll clean this rack up. I still got to get me a networking to put in there because I'm gonna just network the whole house and be a whole lot better than having the Wi-Fi, which I'm still gonna use the Wi-Fi, but I mean, it, it, we just have everything hardwired. It should should work out pretty good. So that's what we got with this. Uh, I'm working on that, but I wanted to do a little video and uh, I mean, I haven't opened the uh, the container yet, so here it is. Have to overlook my garage. Just, I mean, guys, I haven't been here, but I think from August the fifth to now, like four, what, four months, five months, whatever it is. So this thing is packaged well, and uh, I'm really excited to, to crack this bad boy open, and we're gonna get it open. Sooner or later, so there it is. It's got uh, the whole base in there and then it's got the three backs. That's what I heard, it's uh, put together in four pieces, it's got the bottom. You gotta put the backs on and uh, you know connect all the wires and Velcro it and all that kind of good stuff. So that's what we got guys. And my biggest, my biggest thing right now is to get this carpet done. Once I get, I got, all right, all right, I need to cover this. So I got my speaker wire here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna run this speaker wire around the edge here. That's the only thing I know to do. And then I'm gonna fish it up through the wall, come out now. I plan on mounting these wall, these speakers in the wall, but I think I talked myself out of it. I don't feel like cutting the walls and making stuff. So I bought some speaker brackets. Kinda hate to do the speaker brackets, but that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna mount them on the wall till I can come up with something a little bit different. And they give me my front wides and I really want the front wides. I wanna I want to take maximum, you know, I paid, paid a lot of money for that process. I'm gonna use it to its capacity. I'm gonna run a 9.4.6, .4 nine floor channel speakers, six Atmos speakers, four subwoofers. So we're gonna get this thing hooked up and we're gonna get them speakers on the wall. It's probably gonna look, I don't, it's not gonna look as good as I want it to look. And uh, I've been I've been searching for towers. I'd rather have a tower speaker sitting on the floor really than to mount these like that. But I just cannot find a, I can't find a, a RTI 5 or 7 or 9. They just, they're not available. I can find the, the bookshelves, the, the, I think there's the ones, the threes, and there may be a six, RTIA six. So that's what I got with that. So I'm just gonna, I've already got the brackets on the order and uh, when they come in, I, I'm gonna hook them up, which I'm actually gonna hook them up today. That's what I'm working on now. I gotta run, fish this wire, so. We'll get that done, guys. Let's turn this camera around and so uh, type this video. So, so that's my little video for today. Just a little quick update. Got my seat. I want to show y'all the carpet and talk about the panels and the, getting all that done. So, uh, guys, that's my video for today. And we're gonna get this uh, sofa installed here real soon. And we're definitely gonna do a, uh, a video on that. Show you the seat and uh, show you how good it works and. I hope I made the right choice. So, uh, but I see it, guys, and I pray, hope y'all have a good weekend, and we'll see you again real soon.